Hi guys, so today I'm gonna be doing my September Ipsy bag unbagging. So I know it's like super late um, for my Ipsy unbagging. It's the last day of September. Um, I've had my bag for like a couple weeks now and I just honestly forgot to do this video and play with the products and um, one of my products came broken so I was going to fix it and then I was going to contact Ipsy to see if they would send me a replacement but then I figured I could just fix it myself and it's really not that big of a deal it's not broken like that bad so I kind of just kept forgetting about it and putting it off so I'm doing it now but this is what the bag looks like for September it's so pretty I love all the like constellations and um, I love the how the zipper is like a little crystal this is probably one of my favorite bags ever and I know I say that a lot but I really really love um, just this print and design and I love that it does have the little crystal um, and then the the back is just plain but yeah this I really really love this bag design so this is just what the card looks like for this month and then as always it like opens up and tells you what you got and a little bit about the product so the first thing that I got in my, in my bag is from iBalm I'm not completely sure like how to say the brand's name but it's a lemon clay face mask I think this is the brand's name right there so I'm not sure if I'm saying that right but it's just a it's a lemon clay face mask it's supposed to help with your like pores and it's just supposed to uh, give you like a really deep cleanse with like your pore area and stuff like that so I did use this once already and honestly I don't really know how I feel about it because I did only use this once so but I did like it it didn't irritate my skin or anything so I will keep using this and testing it out so the next thing that I got in my bag is from it's from Too Faced and it's their Damn Girl mas like new mascara. So that's just with the little box that it comes in. It's super reflective. And then this is what the actual tube of the mascara looks like. It's super, super cute. I love the like design and pattern, like a geometric shape. Um, I just think the little tube is is really cute. And then... That's what the wand looks like. It's just like a typical hourglass shape and the wand is pretty giant. And also, um, please ignore my super chip nails. I have to do them really bad and I just keep forgetting. So I am wearing this right now. I just, I didn't really feel like putting on um, fake lashes today. So I just used this and um, I mean, honestly, it didn't really do much. Most Mascaras don't do much for my lashes anyways, just because I don't have naturally like good lashes. My lashes are short and they always um, they always like go down. They don't stay curled. So, um, but I mean it's decent, and I will say the formula of this is extremely, extremely wet. So just be really careful when you're um, applying it and the. The wand is pretty like massive so just be careful when you're using it because I did um, kind of get it like everywhere like I said the formula is super super wet so um, I guess if you like a more like clumpy dramatic lash look then you might like this but for me it's just kind of like a okay mascara if it doesn't smudge or flake I might keep using it just for like days when I don't want to wear fake eyelashes so and then the next thing that I got in my bag is from Benefit, and it's their Gimme Brow Brow Volumizing Fiber like Brow Mascara Gel thing. <laughs> the name is like super long, so um, it's just a brow gel. But I got mine in the shade Neutral Deep Brown 4.5, so that's just what the little box looks like. And then this is what the actual little brow gel looks like it's super tiny and super cute that's what the actual like wand looks like so it's really really tiny and nice and I did use this today the shade is like it's a little dark um, so my brows look pretty bold today but 
I really like it. It doesn't feel like hard or crunchy or anything, but it does feel like my brows are going to stay put uh, all day. So I'm excited to keep using this and testing it out. And then the next thing that I got is from this brand called Cest Cest Moi. I have literally no idea how to say that, so I'm really sorry, but this is just what the box looks like. There's the name right there. Um, so, like I said, I don't know how to say that, and it's their Reflect Lip Gloss, so it's a lip gloss. This is what the packaging looks like. It's super cute. I love the little different shapes on the cap, and then um, I got mine in the shade Bliss, so it's kind of like a, um, like raspberry-ish color, and I am wearing this on my lips right now. I lined my lips with the ColourPop Lippy Pencil in the shade Avi because I felt like it kind of would be a good match because they're kind of both like berry toned so like I said I am wearing it right now it's super super comfortable it's not sticky at all it's like really silky and soft and I really love the berry colors so I really like this gloss and I can see myself wearing this uh, a lot so and then the last thing that I got in my bag is from Ofra and it's the Ofra collaboration with Madison uh, Miller. She's a YouTuber on here. I've watched her videos for a couple years now. So this is her collab with Ofra and I got the highlighter in the shade Moon Dance. So um, this is a full size Ofra highlighter and I've never tried Ofra's highlighters before. I got this one. I've tried their uh, liquid lipsticks and I really do like their lipsticks but this is the moon dance highlighter it's so pretty it's what I'm wearing on my face right now it's like super super reflective and blinding I really love this highlight it's just so pretty and this formula is just so like soft it almost like when you touch it it like literally feels like butter it is so soft and um, it is so blinding and reflective, so this is definitely a new favorite highlighter. I really, really love this. Okay, so I did get a few add-ons. The first add-on that I got is from Skin & Co. It's their Truffle Therapy um, Shimmering Oil. This is just what the box looks like. And then this is like the world's tiniest, little, cutest, um bottle of like oil and it is glass and it has a dropper it's just so tiny and cute um i think you can use this for your face and body i'm not like totally sure it doesn't really say like on the box it just says day to night glow and then it's a shimmering dry oil to deeply moisturize and give your skin that youthful glow so um i haven't tried this yet but like I said, I think you can use this on the face and body, but I don't know, I just got it because it was really tiny and cute, and um, I really like oils. I like putting oils on my face, so. And then my next add-on items are actually more of the Ofra and Madison Miller uh, collabs. So I got the liquid lipstick in the shade Oh My Rai Rai. It's just a really pretty, like, mauve -y color which I love these colors I also got the gloss which is in the shade smiley for Riley which is her daughter's name her daughter is super cute um, so I love that her name is like part of the collab and this is what the lip gloss looks like it's just a really pretty peachy shimmery uh, lip gloss and then this is what came broken which is the like blush and highlighter palette so that's what it looks like like I said it did come broken this is the shade that came broken um, but like I said it's not really that big of a deal um, also I do just want to say that um, when I got this as like my add-on I had no idea that this was um, I didn't know that the highlighters are more for like medium to deeper skin tones 
um, on the Ipsy app, like when it showed up as an add-on, the hider highlighters looked like really light, so that's why I got it, and because um, the blush looked really pretty. So after seeing like more pictures and videos after I got this, I realized that this is more for like medium to deeper skin tones, which is really, really great, but um, I can't obviously use the highlighters because they are too dark for me, but I can use the blush and I can use the highlighters as like a eyeshadow or something but after I found out that this was for like medium to deeper skin tones I was gonna like save this for a future giveaway but since it did come broken I don't want to give you guys a broken product so I'm just gonna keep it I did use the blush the blush is really pretty and like I said I can always just use the highlighters as like a eyeshadow or maybe like a blush topper so so yeah that was everything in my september ipsy bag like i said i know um this is like super super late but i still wanted to show you guys the bag and what i got because i really like most of the products so so yeah let me know in the comments what you guys got in your bag i would love to know and i hope you all enjoyed thanks for watching please like and subscribe and i will see you in my next video Bye.